so often there is está hablando el Mifflin de Erland solo cuando tiene una clionda, cabrón. ¿Qué está hablando? Quizá me hubiera hecho el Gaia, ¿no? Teniendo en cuenta que saca contra tres knockups. Bueno, dos, porque el Erland no da knockups. Sin va de huele bastante bien. Y esa rotación del Netroid es una mierda. Aquí tiene que pelear más el Hadis. Metroid hanging around the corner. It's a huge hit for part of the Alex. Into the fight, Twig has to be careful here. The stun's going to come through. Lesbos right behind him. Slice and dice is going to do some damage, and there's the auto attacks to finish off. Free blue. Two versus three. El Hadix ha carreado aquí. Yo creo que eso me puede dar la partida por cierto. That means a decent amount of global gold. We're seeing four to one in totems as well, so a decent amount of global gold there. Jake may be in trouble here. That's a lot of CC, but that's going to be a beautiful coffin from him to try and keep himself alive. But that's a little bit too much on the Camelot Kings here. And awesome Jake's going to be the first one to fall. Lazra has made his way into this engagement, but that double dash, super, super strong. Able to save the life of the Nemesis for now. But Haddock's coming in, double lock up. They're knocking down, going Genetic. Still trying to run away from this damage. But meanwhile, on the top side, Variety's made the rotation over as well. And Lazra's going to fall down. What a messy fight. Netroid with the second rotation at seven minutes. Getting great value out of that. Oh, he's always when he's on the ground. I didn't hear him yesterday. He was a little sick, so but he seems to be playing quite well for himself. Absolutely, and well, Jake actually hold on, getting caught out here. What a beautiful rivers rebuke to stop the the support from going anywhere. Easier, especially if you trap people in his ultimate. Well, just like this, Barracuda in some trouble has to go all the way back towards his tormentors, the Camelot Kings, up and down, and a beautiful riptide from Genetics will claim that. This pass again, they did just know they were on a ward, but they bait Jake in. Yeah, Captain Twig is going to get stunned out, but look at Jake, he has absolutely no protections, and down he's going to fall. Rivers Rebuke was not expected, so Genetics still has that, and there it's going to fall down, blocking off two members, Barracuda and Venenu, stopped away from the fight, but BMT is going to get taken down. By Haddix, who is now caught out in the middle of three, and his health bar is not going to last him much longer than that. Down falls the solo laner, and a two for one trade favoring the Camelot Kings thus far. Gold Fury potentially an option here, still four members, and while they do lose the Oleron, Netroid is still alive. That's exactly what we talked about, Jake. No protections, really. I'm just that Thieves online. Pensaba que se iba a salvar el Haddix después de hacer ese nivel a la Batla y la verdad. Se ve que su equipo no 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 está muy pendiente. Shell in an instant and didn't even need to use Emotrol. Barracuda is here looking for the steal away and he's gonna get it with the swarm of bees now Lazbra coming in with the double Madre kill mía, helped out mía, by eh? his ADC the Olympus bolts take a bad situation flip it on its head and now Variety forced to run away has to use the Aegis but is gonna make it Oof. through the wall the Nainu faster than he will as well I mean even Alex doesn't have all that many Te magic protections in the window blinking into the middle lane and he's dying Barracuda and look at that Rivers rebuke he's tiro. dead before he hits the water wall Netroid Claims that first one. Awesome, bueno, Jake's gonna fall down inside the sanctified field. Madre mía, cómo está la tinta de los Kings, eh? And all the chaos. Yeah, well, the Olympus Bolts were able to pick away a Gold Fury, but two people caught out here in the Rivers Rebuke. Phantom Shell already popped, but Awesome, Jake is dead in the water. And there's the sanctified field. Haddock has to use that enhanced ultimate to use uh, to get that dash off and out of the sanctified field. But the Camelot Kings still pick up one. The Pyromancer definitely not Hadis. off the table, but the Olympus Bolt Hombre, de ver, de ver, no, pero igual hubiera venido bien, aunque no creo. El Erlang ha perdido el knockup. Right, he's right here in the wall. Yeah, el el Olorun, para el Olorun siempre tienes el 3. He's going to fight as well. So confident the Kings right now. Twigs in a bad way, but able to use that turtle form to get away from Benenu's ultimate. No, final judgment on the table for Twigs. Still getting rain to damage upon. Barracuda steps up a little bit too far. Madre he might pay for it with chaval. his life. Captain Twig, though, he's going to get the trade Ooh, out. Oh, oh, oh. Look at that. Captain Twig picks up Barra in a trade for his own little life. Tío. But now the Bolt in a good position loco. to take the Pyro. Yeah, give that win to the Bolts there. I got a little messy on the Kings, pulling the objective, dropping it, trying to poke them, trying to find the Eevee's big ultimate. Wow, but this is a mierda, no? The Navy dashing in. Onto Variety, he Yo, could be in a lot of danger wow. here, but off the mark is the end for Variety, and now Benenu turning around, but there's the River's Rebuke, forcing the bird into an even worse spot, but Variety now not able to catch up to him, that dash truly so far, and now Variety has to get out, the Aegis expended, but Captain Twig on the top side, able to find Benenu, should pay it for it with his life, though Barracuda trades that one out. Again, Twig just finding someone in the back line, but a huge ultimate from Big Game, never mind, puta mierda de ulti, pensaba que la había tirado bien. 
Damage is coming. Baps and Twig to get back. This is going to be a 4v5. This is the hard part for the Bolts as well. They know they have to fight around Fire Giant eventually, but it's so much easier for Yamoja to find big walls here. Already Haddix falling down low. Genetics just trying to put some disruption on the board. Jake caught out. Good Look match. at these Reptides. Three back to back. Awesome. Jake forced to use the beads. The Phantom Shell. Not going to save you know, the life yeah, of the support. Now going right on, on the aggressive Netroid up into the sky. Looking to find some extra damage. Barracuda getting crit there with the explosion. Netroid though is taking some damage from the Thoth. Has to dash into that wall to save his Can own life. Now awesome. Walk. Jake is off Tavila the board. Deal. There's still a lot of bit very quickly. So if they do get a pick on Jake again and make some space, like maybe an opportunity here. Twig blinking no, board into so. four people. Variety. Sorry, Venenu, the one targeted Please. out. Look at the damage from Netrioi. Downfalls Barracuda. The Rover's rebuke comes through, blocking Jake's puff to the Yo rest of the team. He's going to fall before he gets up onto the coffin. Venenu now. The next target, potentially Lazbra holds. They'll be able to DPS it down relatively quickly, but Lazbra and Haddix trying their best to defend. on the Fire Giant okay, Haddix long. is really far up though. Has to use that ultimate. The pin's coming through, but the dash does not care about your puny root. Captain Twig, though, has been left by the rest of his team, and he's gonna fall down. Lazra able to find that one. Now the fire giant too low to drop. They have to Ooh, find it! Fall. But yeah, once yeah. again, the bolts steal it away! I think that was an auto attack out of Lazbara as well, just perfectly timed based on through those crits from Big Man Tings as well. Oh, no, no. wins the 1v1 up against Haddix in the back line. I'm sorry, variety in the back line as well, so isn't able to is able to come back into this team fight, get some artillery damage off and chase them down with that fire giant in hand. And Variety is getting artillery. These shots from Doth so powerful at the moment. Haddix chasing la robao, the, la, el lasbo, la robao, no, members of the Camelot Kings Lamentable, out of the Olympus tío. Bolts. Lamentable, walk away bro. with yet another jumping up into the sky. Netrioid is looking to get aggressive onto Haddix. The damage isn't quite there though. The ultimate from Haddix should save his life unless yeah, Captain yeah, Twig's able to find that pin. The taunt's good. Yeah, Variety coming out of the woodwork to try and find him but Lazbra able to find the turn around. Captain Twig is melting but so is Lazbra and down he falls. Netrioid claims first blood. On this front line, Lazbra. Venu getting a decent amount of poke on him. Lazbra's holding around the left hand side. Haddix caught in the river. Look, 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 He's gonna be able to say. get out just fine. Right, he is hit by the final judgment, and now Captain Twig in some big trouble. Goal. Pull back in. Awesome, Jake. Big Man Ting is gonna take that one, but he's falling down low in the sanctified fields. Haddix able to find the first kill. Yo, on that eh, one. Lazbra, se habla de lo bien que está jugando Last Bolt. Eh? Have fallen from the Camelot Kings. A huge swing for the Olympus Bolts. Haddix does have to back, and this could be some space for the Fire Giant to go down. Yeah, I think finally now, Bolts are in control of this game. They should be able to get this Fire Giant for free. I guess they were in control before when they were sieging, but that was nullified by a good pick on Lazbara eventually. Now they actually win a team fight. That's a huge boost to their mental right now. Able to win a team fight against this team fight composition, that is the Kings. I think we just didn't see a great wants to dive as well. He doesn't really want to be hitting a frontliner, so this should be a relatively free Phoenix. There's still, still two people down on the side of Kings, and they're able to just walk over to mid now as well. Has that mantle of Discord as well, so Haddix right. truly yeah. unkillable at this point in time as the Playing right Phoenix falls down. Jake looking to pull back in someone. It will be Variety and he's getting hit by all sorts of damage to beads. Forcibly, forcibly expended and that's going to be Lazbra trying to find a little bit more. I can will die Activated and Lazbra falls down low. The pin's going to find him and two people caught out in the river. There's the sanctified field. Awesome Jake falls down. Venenu falls it's down. And the Camelot idea. Kings from a two Phoenix deficit. They I think could. this could be an opportunity for the Camelot Kings to end. Three members of the Olympus Bolts have 20 plus have no second ults. cooldowns. EBR, then, they don't have ultimates, but it's only a a Barracuda and Haddix here. There's a lot of damage on this Camelot King side. The Titan already falling down. Captain Twig looking to find the damage on the Barracuda. Titan at half HP already. And the Camelot Kings should be able to pick up that Titan, but the damage has slowed down. Variety Uf. able to. Un combo a mana jungla, tío. Verás tú el Twig, hermano. Like if he wanted to, but instead he'll keep it, get the vision. Esto se defiende so fácil, eh. Pyromancer, but I don't think they can do it in front of Haddix right now. Potentially not. No, there is a lot of auto attack damage. Es que si the haces eso, Haddix se está soleando, cabrón. From the bolts isn't quite going to take that one off. Variety once again. Lazra off the mark with the ultimate, but a three-man stun from Haddix. Not much follow-up to be heard of. Two people caught out in the sanctified no field. Sé, but no them, but the there. wall from Jake stops BMT and genetics from getting out, and it's there for so long. The Scarab's blessing is gonna pull Big Man Ting straight back into four. See, this gives them enough. La que 16 minutes. To el muro es una salvajada si te lo subes, eh. Wow, Variety stepping up, but he is no sé all yo, alone. Eh, si Twig is on his way here. We might be able to see the first big baby of the game. And
and there it is. Up, down, Variety looking to find some damage. Barracuda could be the target, but Madre so far, Captain Mana, Quick eh? just storming. Le trying to find some stuff, Barracuda. Claro, pichas, si es que está cuajado. Rally towards this fire giant, though, but genetics caught out. So is Captain Twig, and the knockup from Haddix caused them to take so much damage. The turnaround potentially there. But up into the colossal fury, Captain Twig goes. Nothing really to gain from it, though. The Olympus Bolts force a very big ultimate from the uh, from the Kings. Yeah, Kings are in a tough spot right now, completely zoned out. El cabrón de Slabra, lo único que ha hecho es comprarse crítico para pegarle al fire. On this fire giant, by the looks of it, they are baiting in a little bit. They're ready to turn on somebody. Let's see what target they choose. They don't want to commit fully. You choose the old. Three people line up for Lazarus ultimate. The sanctified field slows them down long enough. But Lazarus getting turned on, and now he's the first death of the engagement. El puto tres de Lazarus acaba de traspasar la peña por el shell ese. Question uh, Scarab's blessing saves the life of the support, but Para falls down here too, Ro. And what what happened? I would call that a good engage on part of Lazbra, but this team Me is just logo, split eh? because Captain Twig and Variety are kind of in the backline, annoying the enemy backline, so they're not able to nullify or not able to capitalize, sorry, on that big Mercury ultimate. Two people stunned out. Up down from Variety finds Venenu and Awesome Jake, and now the damage is coming through. Venenu falls down. Jake oh, has no. a very long way to go before he's in safety, and instead will find himself on the gray well, scale. Look, this this is a fantastic sí, position no for the Camelot Kings. Haddix, the only man left standing. We saw Lasper do it last game. Can <laughs> Haddix steal it away this time around? Variety try. says no. Okay, smart by Variety. They learned that range auto attacks, maybe get a couple crits, and that would have forced the Kings out, but. I think Bolt's just buying time right now. I, I can't imagine they really want to fight this full 5v5. They do have the help of their tier 2 tower, but it's not going to be here long. And the zoning for Variety is so good. Up and down for Captain Twigs running into Vodnenu. Nearly falls down, but there's going to be the ult. But the save from Genetics keeps his jungler alive and in the fight. What a beautiful scary blessing there by Haddix's ultimate, but no follow-up yet again. The Olympus Bolt's not really following up a lot in these well, fights and now look at the damage mucho, coming through jake potentially caught up. out here with this wall stopping genetics from engaging but the damage suddenly pulls through onto jake and down falls the unit up and down two people in haddix forced the beats genetics yeah, onto no, the horse but they do does pop that sanctified field but the damage is still mira, 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 down he baby. falls captain twig choose through one choose through two Huge. barracuda falls down and now it's just nice, lazar and haddix to defend the titan and that's all it took just a bit more confidence out of the end of kings they're able to catch Jake out, a, a very immobile Ymir, and Jake on his death falls away and is squeezed out. His relics are squeezed out. He, he sprints, he unks, and all of a sudden this unk is no longer a problem for Captain Twig, so he's able to just go big baby, walk that Vermana, uh, walk that Vermana right down the lane and, and clean him up. Five man strong, they're still looking for the damage. Sonic Boom finds that trio, but it's too little, too Se late. The Titan falls down and the Camelot Kings in a 2-0 victory will move on to the winner's side. Joking es in the interview cabrido. about seeing you know, six hunters on the top, but cojones. the Jade Dragons and the Titans hunter, uh, uh, you know, Oh no! There, six carries. Six on the, on the, on the what, a, what a meta that we're in, Cosita. my friend. So which one's fine? Okay, is the question. Pero I, I, really, I, I have not seen si him play. I have seen everyone else on the Jade Dragons play. I have not seen him 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 We'll see what happens. And he's still hanging out there, there is. because and this is going to be the first opportunity for him. Yeah. There's the blink. This is going to be the pull. Ooh. But just like you said, it's in the Sanctified Fields. They're just on the side, so the damage is there. But oh, oh, oh. he's turning this around, and now they've got Sot to get the damage out. Mike goes down for first blood. Roar is going to get chased down by all five Oye, members of the Titans. 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 Soccer. Tienen dos ulti globales en las líneas laterales y un puto lorun en la del medio, tío. Eh, con un Kumba. O sea, lo único que me, lo único que me está perturbando es la, la Willis. Pero aún así está contra un Uller Jingwei. O sea que. Madre mía, tú. Better than anything we could have asked for. He's got the sovereignty and he's got the Emperor's armor. So far, that's enough to make him tanky. Sots getting low. Y yo, pero y ese puto Aegis. He's going to save his life this time around. At least for now, the dive is on from Fine. Okay, he's moving forward up to the sky. Goes S O T. Fine. Okay, Soft. takes way too much damage, and now the chase is on. But it's going to be nice, the leap in the jungle. Dude. Trying to do everything. The wall ah, saving Soul mundo. Patrol. Finally, Sam is able to get the kill. But look how deep he is. And where are they going to go? Paul is waiting. The damage is there, and the Titans pull back too.
The Titans might be able to get a little bit more playing a warrior. <laughs> Walks in, he lost like 50% to a structure. Yeah, mete gol. Now, rotation from Cyclone Spin as well. Mike is in a bad spot. Can't a ver, yo diría que Benzema 100% va a meter. Hizo la, las dos cantadas de su vida en la final casualmente contra el Madrid. Bale metió un gol de chilena después de hacer puta mierda durante toda la temporada. Lo del Madrid no tiene nombre. O sea, es el mejor equipo de la Champions. Siempre está. Luego te hacen una liga de 60 puntos, pero da igual. Uh, no sé yo el Ayers. Que no digo que esta sí ha sido de 60. Too sure about how they want to re -engage them. El Mbappé va a echar a Neymar que es que Messi y Sergio Ramos seguirán. Messi va a ser el recoge pelotas y Sergio Ramos se va a dedicar a baloncesto. Muy bien, Mike. 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 The Jade Dragons jungler has got his ultimate, so Sam for Soccer's got two great targets. Well, there's the Sanctified Fields. It looks like the Phoenix might just be the target. Mike is just taking shots, Triple though, whiff. trying to no keep sé, Sam, this up si as best as possible. As possible. Phoenix Phoenix is taking a long time to get that ball is low. No has to fall back here on board. No tanky, but not tanky well, enough. Tenía beats, pero se la ha Dragons seem to have a whole hell of a lot of this. At least for a little bit longer. Yo me hubiera pillado un puto tir solo, chaval. Anda que no iba a gastar beats. O pulear peña con un Ares o una valle en mi equipo, eh. No ultimates available. It's time to take the bird. Yeah, they walk yeah, forward. Yeah. The Phoenix finally goes down, but will they get away? Chains on the Cyclones, man. Aegis gets used, Great and mess. Cyclones gonna get out of here. A roar. Poco se habla de que la no va cero quince. The Titans eh. are just a giant. Uh, will it happen? Uh, who knows? It's already started up and being burned Madre down mía, immensely by the Titans. They're gonna be able to secure that one, and now it's just the aggression Yo, forward by Okay. He's taking a lot of hits. Mike months. is looking for the pull, and he's actually gonna get layers this time around, but it costs him his life, and instead the Dragons again running away. Fine Okay's gone. Sam is gonna fall shortly thereafter. Double kill for Sot, Pagon, and Panda. One more time just trying to stay alive, and this time they're at least going to have the distance to do so. Now the Tartarus Titans, five strong with Fire Jack, can start to work their way into the oh, base no. of the Jade Where's Dragons. Where's he going? Who needs a Phoenix? He's going for the Titan. Yeah, he's going in. I want to know. He's going goal. for some kills. There's the damage on the Pagon. The knockup is good. The egg is a little better on the other side, oh, but the dead. crit, the damage is too much. The Titan is being sieged down. Panda Cat trying to do whatever Vamos he can. Ahí, esos but unfortunately, titans. it is not enough. The Titans in a clean 14 to do win. Now I'm thinking that this Una Athena puta was not going to support. Tío. Maybe that this is actually going to be Athena jungle you talked you touched on earlier. Yeah, I mean, it, o sea, Athena jungle. I think I think Athena's going to be in the jungle and then cositas, ¿no? Knocks, fine, okay, just going back to a trip a little more. Así como data perturbadora. Me pueden decir por lo menos. One of the safest top three guaranteed, no matter what. When it comes down to hunter play, me pueden dar una fecha por lo menos. Que no sea más de dos mil dos. 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 Que no that he's going to pick up. Mike, though, picked up, pulled back, and taken it's down done. below. Circle of protection is going to be just Got barely up, but Paul dude. still finds the kill. Now the chase is on for the dragon. No, no, no. Paul's the target nah, finder. Okay, pulled heels. back, and what a good stun. They stop that King Arthur, and with Sam
Continue to see how this one shakes and out. Buddy, Sambo see. might be isolated. Pulled back, silenced, nice, and chased down. Boys. Killed off in the jungle. The dragon's unable to respond and help their jungler. And now the primal fury looks free. Circle protection was used to finish off the kill. So la verdad, me da pena porque el Sam me cae bastante bien. Goes unexplored by the Jade Dragon. That's the thing that's always deceptive about these late game fights. Sot takes a lot, but Ooh. no, it's Mike. Pulled back in and killed off. Fine, okay. Barely gets out of Oi. there, and he's not gonna make it very far. Cyclone spin gets the last hit, gets the kill, and now the Titans are just running through. They're looking to take down every single dragon they can. Aegon's gonna stay alive this time. The triple zeros stay alive in his slash line. But they lose out on so much more. Right now, Mifflin, six kills to nothing. Uh oh, uh oh. Like he might be in trouble. A fire giant for the Titans, but they lose Sot. And maybe just playing too deep. I mean, that's just that circle of protection. They can move Buena forward. Tier two el troll. Is going to go crumbling down. Y el panda cat es un psicópata, tío. Que hace con la mierda del pinche de Spinner. Four dragons occupied on left, and two of them are getting low. Fino K is getting chased down. One more hit. It's all they need, and Paul finds the kill. Si ganan los Titans se acaba por hoy. Negativo. Ahora hay loser bracket y winner bracket. Espero que haya winner bracket de momento. O sea, winner bracket. Bueno, sí. Yo, el solo troll va full daño, el cabrón, eh. They're gonna go into the mid Phoenix, and again, it's the primary target, and it is working out well for the Titans. A couple more hits, and they're gonna clear that one. Y le han contestado en cinco minutos lo que a mí me han estado ignorando un mes. Lo he visto en el pixelancillo. Cyclone opened the door for layers to walk through. That's the glory of having a cleaner who can just go through the wall anyway. Create that opportunity, although Sot's getting low. A roar's Ooh. there. And the damage was here. Blessing on him, so that's going to help him get out of there. But now a roar doesn't have that target. That's going to be the go button for the dragons. They're trying to get the damage out there. Ooh, el sol troll huge damage, eh? Mira, 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 mira. Qué buena ulti, cabrón, ha tirado, eh? For one, they get two as Sam follows shortly into the grave. Panda Cat goes down the left side. Phoenix joins them. And Pagan and Fine, okay, have a lot to do for the defense. Do they have the damage? Not when they're focused out that way. The Titan is going to go down. The Titans are gonna move for some great matchups. Pomona, Artemis, Ra, Erlong, Shan, even Capri all gonna struggle mightily up against those walls. Eh, puta mierda, estoy bien, no. To pressure this game early, obviously with a Mercury, you're looking at some lane gank potential. Yeah. And then you're also looking at this Erlong Shan, which has the blink available, and he's looking for an invade here towards the blue buff. He'll meet layers around the blue area. He's the one we want. Trade off between two for now. You say that. Pomona is on the way too, as layers starting to lose that trade against Twig and Solo or Troll jumps on in. He's thinking about throwing the axe and will Pulls connect, it. Paul. Now rotating in, as you said. Spirit Ball's big onto Captain Twig, who is now dead for first blood. Huge. And this could be number two as now Barati's body blocked in place. But not enough basic attacks coming through just yet from the Titans. Ooh, you, 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 you. But he's not going to live much longer against the trio. No. Himself in this game. Interesting to see the beats pick up from Genetics on Capri as well, but I do feel at the stage of the game that he's choosing it here, it's probably a good go to for safety. Big Man Tings isolating from getting back towards mid lane as Twig gets against Paul. Yo, no le ha nada, cabrón. But it's not enough for a kill. Pimp from Twig does What? SOT. Sasole Alvarietti con una puta velona. Aurora is still alive, but for how much longer? Over the war, Big Man Tings finds it. Nice, the and Liars. Onto Twig should be his death, or is it because Genetics is there? He'll force Genetics back. Great abduct from him, though, to make sure he's. Teammates close, nice but still Twig falls down. Genetics could be a cyclone. Yes, Twig but Khan needs a couple more things. Twig will well. with SOT rotating around and Edward can't goal. find a tail and kill. Look now Big Man Tings has Ooh. one health left, and there's not a whole lot he can do. The Spirit Ball comes through to the back of his head, but speak in the back of his head. Netroid needs man, one more on SOT. He's crazy, dude. What the fuck is he doing with that Uller, man? Pressure rolling. Variety still has his ultimate, so I'm not sure how he got soloed there, especially being a Bologna into a Hunter as well. But he's not happy about it. Misjudged the, I guess the amount of damage, maybe the cooldown reduction. Que muy buena speed del Uller, criminal, eh? And now Twig has to run away. SLT giving chase, looking for an axe, and we'll find out Variety. Walls drop down by a roar, followed by the stun. The CC chase, beautiful, but a counter CC from Twig turns it around. The budget's gone, but running off, it leaps in SLT, looking for an axe on Oh, huge ulti. And Twig falls for a double kill. Oh, repair. What? Variety doesn't even get his ultimate off there. I think he got. Have you seen the ulti del del big man? Se hacía aquí. Just sitting there in the tremors. Casi eso. Even though she has a channeled ability on her one, it doesn't matter because a lot of the time you're just using that. Players get a bit aggressive. 
does get pulled in by Twig. Nice Forced beats. to be very late in the day there. And in comes Variety with a perfect Eagles rally, but the backup from his team wasn't there. Sonic Boomba weighs just enough to split the difference, but he's still running for his life and gets the blink up in time. SOT did a good job healing, but now can he get away himself? Twig trying to whittle him down and will dive the tower, but this tower hurts, baby! And he falls down very soon after. Big Man Team think of the snipe off, but as he does, Paul on a roll collapse and trap him in the pit. SOT turns back up, can't find the axe, but... Big Man Tings can't find an escape, and they're going to wait out the ultimate from Genetics. Oh no, they don't! Isa explode in the worst time! Variety falls down, Genetics and BMT will survive. All of a sudden, two people down, Captain Twig coming out of base. I don't think they can get to this fire giant in time if they even have yeah, then they would be able to opportunity to. I think we we'll see where SOT was positioned. He's on zone work. Pero cuajaísimo. I think gets that tier 2 tower, still finding gold and forcing Camelot Kings to defend. And now Genetics is a little bit too far forward, needs some support, won't get it, has to ult himself. Meanwhile, Netro can't get for the wall. El Cyclone se tendría que haber metido en el Fenix, tío, para divear con el Lion, o sea, con el Sword Troll, perdón. Uh, Hugh Chagis, though! He's a pira! He jumps back in the middle of 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 the middle one. Me quedo loco. One, and we're on the Phoenix is on the left hand side. Bueno, ya sabemos que van a ganar uno en la siguiente partida. Why I don't want to go home and play ranked right now is because people <laughs> are picking Ula in my ranked games. They're picking AMC solo in my ranked games, and it's just not fun to play against Variety having a nightmare game loco, right now. Solo troll having one of the games of his life right now. What an Aegis on that Ras snipe. Perfect reaction yeah, timing, yeah. and it must have been just the sound that tipped him off. And sometimes sound is so important in the game it of Smite that a lot of people don't realize. There's too many people who play with music. It's uh, I can't stand it, honestly. It tilts me. I, I'm going to call him out here, but adapting used to do that. Two-time world mean, champion, loved his music. I mean, music. when you're that good, dude. Yeah, like, yeah. Whatever. I, like, I couldn't tell him no. Yeah, That's exactly. right. I was coaching them. I was like, oh, that hey, doesn't hey, seem right to me, but it works. Hey, adapted, why don't you not use that? You know, and he's like, yeah, whatever. I still want. He just picks up his hand and he's got two Nice old deal. Nice and nice. Snipe from BMT will boost his damage. Not peek his head around this corner. But I don't think we'll see a huge defense out of the Kings here. They're really going to look for this Phoenix oh. defense because there's no Phoenixes. No, well, they've got one chance, and that's in the right lane. But when you've got one chance, and you hand side and layers may look for the option for Sonic Boom through. Is the middle the Phoenix is already near enough dead already? Cyclone Spin did get pinned there, but it's not enough to weather him away. Genex being looked at has to be early on. Worried about the damage coming through from layers and the CC. SOT finds a nice axe on to mid and blow it up. I think that's maybe the one chance Kings might have. You know, maybe they win. Paul was the instigator more than that's anything right. else. He was, honestly. He and was. him doing that made it open the door for SOT to run away with this game with layers in backup. Genex and Varian Twig trying to frontline away, protect the Titan with eating those basic attacks where they can. Varian not down to half health. La verdad que no sé de qué estaba hablando él. Either way, the snipe hits two from BMT, but the damage check is... La verdad que no sé de qué estaba hablando él. The Titan seems to be, they want minions in there tanking it forward. El Rowe. And to try and just pick... Como si no pudieran finishar ahora mismo, literal. They just have to make a call at some point and just say, you know what, we're healthy enough, we can... Que se han desmotivado y que este meta no les favorece. Les ha podido pasar lo de los campeones, que se relajan y ya, o directamente que se metan los favoritos, el directamente que YouTube. Vaya puta mierda que van a hacer los titans. And in doing me so, encanta cuando me dejan mal. Back. So down there, right hand side, blocked by minions, but a good pull onto Twig there, who gets caught by SOT. Ay, the old 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 old. The snipe from BMT wasn't enough and didn't find a home. Good revive from Genex, so to keep Natural. Hey, man, no entiendo por qué le está costando tanto. Actually, SOT still gets Ay, out. Ay, Samuel, mal, tío. Twig commit ends up falling down to Cyclone, and now the double kill. They move on towards the Titan. Genex and Natural there, but no ultimates available. The burst damage is not going to be enough to bring them down. You can see Titans trying to whittle down the health bars as well as the Titan, but game one will go to the top. The Bologna locked in will shine a light on the rest of this draft, so I think we can very accurately identify Me that. Gusta la materazu, la verdad. Which would leave Pero AMC una velona. mid artist corner. Metroid now joining in two. Pressure in favor of the Titans, but that's all she wrote. Unless Le uh, Genex gets caught here, and he does pull back in to the sanctuary as well. And Genex should be first blood here, unless a mistake oh. is made. Paul granted for nice one, speak. as SOT has rotated with variety towards mid to keep big man teams well, and variety at bay. Free 
Pyromancer locked no, no. by the Kings. Rotation coming in from the Titans too. A raw trying to wrap round the back as the Sonic Boom does come no, in. Kings Ooh. get the Pyro. Layers pulled into danger, but there's no follow up no. damage. Eagles rally from Variety to split the difference and fall back. But he's picked up and Dios mío, el aro, pensaba que le iba a cagar otra vez. Variety could be another casualty here. He's looking for a killer. Layers in the tail end and won't find it. Even the bees won't be enough as SOT takes his life. Too much right now, I'll be honest. I don't think it's great into the carries and I don't think it's great into crit. Because, uh, for example, I don't think he can walk into this gold fury. This fury's down too quick at the end of the day. Kings will it. steal it though. Janex gets it with the circle of protection. Tusky comes into play, but beads are used multiple times by Titans. And Janex will fall down. My my and Tusky do. BMT doing Worth, right. no? The, the damage is done there, but Kings are happy. That evens out in a way. Pues so si se ha pillado el animón si tiene ¿Cuánto pelas con eso? Uy, el Twig está muerto aquí, ¿no? Twig's in trouble here on the right side. Has to beat away and leap. Aurora gonna give chase. Nolte, Nolte, Nolte. Uh, eso voy a haber salido tan mal si el puto Twig no estuviera cuajado. Out of there has to beat away. Paul, stunned in place from Janex over the wall, which really prevented some damage on variety there. Janex did a really good job of just like poking, saying, no, Free fire. No, Paul, you won't play. But the FG could be looked at here. They have the DPS for it. We're talking about ¿Cuánto quita fast. el Animosity? Now it's time. 67 o 28. ¿Qué estoy viendo? No sé qué estoy viendo. Ojo el sword troll. Ojo. Uh, era bueno el disarm. Free fire. Netro y cuando quieras empezar a jugar le das. eh Amaterasu will increase the DPS as well. Variety using his ultimate up down is very surprising. But then gets pulled back into the fray. Now Variety surrounding big uy, 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 uy. Netra trying to support, but Netra is Están jugando muy, muy bien los Kings, esos retakes, eh, del fire. Es como están carreando esos últimos 3-4 streaming de 8 horas, eh. Eso está muerto bien, bien. Esto es GG ya para los. Para los Titans. Nevermind, llega Netroid. Llega Netroid. If they can actually stay on this FG, I don't think it's easy with no sé yo, el Ayers. Fenner jumping in as well. He doesn't have Fenner. No sé yo, el Ayers. Not too strong here, but Amaterasu able to outbox anybody in the back here. Not la verdad que el solo troll está jugando lights out, eh. El Ador con Cynthia es otro rollo. 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 Es buena todavía, eh. Es buena todavía, eh. Netroid again out of mana. Meanwhile, Variety is taking on the world, and the world just crushes him. Sí, pero solo el troll se ha muerto. Os ha gustado el fichaje de la lava este? Porque ya las veces que lo he visto ha hecho una de mierda. Will peel himself away, but it cost him his beads. It cost him his other relic as well as his ultimate, and his life is still going to fall down too. Ten to one now for the Titans. As once again, you look at Variety and Twig. Stop them one more time. In goes Twig. He's on the forefront, waiting for Variety to join him. Fire Giant just getting towards half health now. Netroid, better sí. angle this vale, time, vale. joining the rest of his team. Curioso. Remember, Tusky will jump around that pit if given the angle. And they Una insulti de Baul, eh? Ragnarok forced, and Ragnarok looking for a target. Picks up a roll, brings him to the team, and a roll goes down. Fire Giant off the fray is Tusky. It's worth, it's worth. El error es una, es, es, es una mierda, no sirve para nada. long time there. And now with two members dead on the Kings, the Titans go back to it again. A roll went down, but it makes enough space for them to pull this objective. They have a lot of sustain, and they cannot get past Cyclone Spin right now. We're just seeing a Mercury and Amaterasu do the Fire nice. Giant while they carry this. Well, hold on a second, let's find out. You were talking about Kings do secure it, and then straight after he goes on Netroid. Oh, genetics. Now, yeah, throw on on genetics who's ah, sí, sí, it down again. The yep. enemy team is just backing to spend their gold after the Fire Giant. You wouldn't expect them to be there so far, but Amaterasu oh. and Jingwei very fast out of base. And another pick. Jing. got is really the beats to defend them. Sonic Maybe Boom connects with Netroid, but straight away the beats comes into play. Talalai was the arm as Tusky that denied it. Now Layers traps on the left hand side, but well, all the wild times assault in the middle Phoenix. No minions there though means it's taken a long time to go down here. El Genetic si estaba llorando antes después de haber piqueado esta easy, vamos, tiene que estar echando unos lagrimones. Ni me lo enseñan al cabrón. I can't imagine he'll live too long in this front line though. They're looking at Genetic one more time, knocking him up in the air, but Cyclone stepping forward to support and gets eaten alive by Netroid. Ooh, Nada worth, eh. Oh, uh, está medio trolling aquí, eh. El variety se ha columpiado, eh. Honestly, there is also a trebuchet over there, and the guests they're worried about the initial siege, but 
You like you don't like this call? No, I would have preferred. So you're all going to lead him the charges right. He tries to zone away the two in this middle area. Now Captain Twig comes in, looks towards Layers. Layers forced to beads away. Eats two punches to the back of his head. Does Twig on his exit. Sonic Boom charge. Don't think it'll get used. Pressure relieved on the right hand side for a second or two. A Cyclone starts cleaning up camps. And now SOT in on this middle Phoenix. You can see that. Ah, que eso también le hace daño al. Well, so quite a lot of damage no, on, the, on the structures from Solo or Troll. And I like the move to yeah. have to force Bologna to stay into the mid lane. So these two hunters on the right side of the map do not get disarmed. So we can see both Phoenixes go down at the same time. The middle is starting to whittle down slowly. And every time you see a rotation from BMT, you see a bit more poke towards the right hand side too. Circle of protection now down for Let's genetics. That's two ultimates down on the side of the Kings here and still Titans with everything not. Yeah, yeah, mucho por nada, para nada, for time. All they want is this fire giant buff to tick away. But this is why I said they should have the EFG. Quedan dos minutos, no sé qué está hablando, Rowe. They had that EFG buff by now. Sonic Boom being charged again by Lee. Still looking for a play in towards this mid lane. No. Twig and Bright stepping up, trying to keep SOT at bay. SOT now tanking the Phoenix and does so. He does have the Emperor's army. You saw Doug show us off a little bit earlier right. on, reducing that damage and that separation Uf, opened the door for Titan to take out right side looking around this right hand side looking to ult on in Aurora going to try and force some beads early el putador eh dando con la batidora the rest of the team still fine I tell a lie Jonex's beads also down and you can see SOT just trying to will these minions in towards the titan room and call people to defend sobre, but if they come back to defend they're going to lose the left hand phoenix too a good play from Uy, SOT no yet again today like an MVP eso. for me so far yep. with how this series has gone Still, though, Kings hold on. No tiene pinta que haya sido fuera de juego, ¿no? Sí. His team, he's able to give layers an opportunity to ult in that left lane because the enemy team is looking mid. And you can look at like Cyclone and layers both dashing in aggressive, trying to force them back. Oh my God! Where did the Madre mía, los críticos. Yes, even the game couldn't read the damage was that much. It just deleted. That was like a Thanatos ult, if anything. Now they still have the Oleron ult, so it's up to them when they want to pull this trigger. If they just want to drop that ult, fight in it, then they can do that. But the ADCs need to split up, otherwise they're going to get disarmed by variety. Look at Twig though. Losing half his health already. A roll pulled in and now gets away again. Sanctify field down. Titan. Right, just gonna go to Eagles Rally to try and slow down the pressure. And his body block city needs to happen, but it won't be enough. As the Tartarus Titan it helps a little bit in that regard. You might be able to dash forward, or you have your CC you mean alt to walk. He said, I'm gonna I mean I think it's smart at this back on a riff. Really rotating too at five minutes. Hold that thought. Jake is gonna find Sam for soccer here. Sam does have the crack available, gets taunted back through, will find that crack, and it's jumped over by Lasbro. But Lasbro is gonna get hit by the axe sauce after one more auto. Ooh. It's all that it's needed to take down Lasbro, and Pagon will jump on top of his head to take him down for first blood, but can Panicat find a way out? No, we cannot. It's Venenu picking up the kill. Porque el Hadis no la ha el He probably well, not gonna put himself too far out of position just for a purple buff. Finds that double Cobra's kiss, but still, even with the help of Sam, he's not gonna get Porque a purple buff. Instead, he's gonna lose. The Pyro, the first neutral objective of the game, goes to the Bolts. And now it looks like Haddix might be the target here. PBM looking for any bit of CC, and that dazzling offensive should nice be the end of this chase, as it looks like. Yeah, it looks like Pandacat ulted in on the left side. Whoa, Barracuda versus Pandacat in that one. Might just go to Pandacat, the second dash is through oh. to the exact they, they trade out. Instead, for now, Barrel will just go ahead and clean up those Harpy camps. Fine, okay, in danger, dashing offensive, not gonna find the Oy. stun. Oh. And that could have been the death of Final K. He'll walk himself out the wall, but it's a slow ride on top, and Final K will go down to the double okay, warrior no, out of the Olympus yeah, Bolts. Yeah. They've got four up on the board. PBM trying to get things going, though, with Venenu, who'll use the beads and back himself away. The answer will be shortly after that. Some of the damage coming up against this Yemoja for now, but still holding on to beads. Final K. Mira, 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 We'll take down Fine OK. Can they find a path out? The root is good. Kraken is available to Sam, but he's not going to fire it yet again. It will this time, but Lasberg can just jump out. Yeah, back in from base. B. A little bit of time. Mike will go in with the last breath. He'll get stunned by Venenu. He had exceeding a lot of crit damage in the back line. Use that dash oh, offensive in Final K, defensively yeah. this time. Rivers Rebuke come out, but it will not save Jake. Final K finally able to find a kill and fight. Pagon jumps into the back line, finds the tech sauce onto Venenu. Needs a couple more shots to take him down. It will find it. Pagon picks up the second kill, but now PBM is the one in danger. Last has got to open up out. And the siempre, Jade Dragon's two around the Pyro. Bueno, hacer so algo nice bien, cabrón. Back. What are they going to get with it, though? Do they just get the Pyromancer? Or after the fact with this many dead haddocks, oh, he's gonna need to crack it here. He's gone. Gone. Eliminated, erased from the map. Doesn't matter. Finally, Yo, with Sam is able to let one of these crackets rip on a target he can hit. Tanto we can see how much damage they do. And that's for the fire giant for the Jade Dragons. 
They it's a slow this. burn with Barracuda around Pagon ah, centro, eating. Bro. Basic after basic from Barracuda. Lasbra here. ¿Qué está this is a coin sum, tío, no, Not sure the Dragons alguien? want to take. Lasbra finds Sam. Barra gets fine, okay. Barra will dash himself out. Panda Cat needs one more auto, but he won't find it. It'll be Pagon who grabs him with the Hail of Arrows after. The Fire Giant has been split push left. Remember, he can join the fight whenever he wants with that ultimate. Someone is going to have to stop him once he gets to the Phoenix, and that's going to be the go button. Panic's going to go in right away. Finds PBM, but another Whirlpool. Will no keep sé, the porque ahora se tanto no me convence. Eh, no, no. Panacat can continue his split push on the left side for as long as necessary. The Bolt will try and force something by grabbing the enhanced fire giant up. Already half HP. Final K in the wall. PBM goes to the back line, pops the young, and then ended up grabbing Venenu all the while. But PBM is being accosted by the fire giant, but the rest of the bolts starting Buena to fall low. The damage ¿no? from all of these carries is starting to pile in. And it's Pagon who finally strikes first in the fight. Awesome Jake, the first one out. But Barracuda got Pagan. Oh, massive Kraken. We'll end up tagging Barracuda Vaya. in the worst spot possible, right in front of Pagon for the double. And it looks like Haddix and Lazbra are the only ones left in the J Dragon. Are trying to it's the J Dragons to stop this yeah, enhanced yeah, fire yeah. giant from going down. Yeah, Haddock yeah, being zoned away by a Final K who is doing a lot of damage back. PBM jumps in, finds a ton on the last, but gets the beads from the Osiris and throws them right back to the rest of the team. A leap in by Pagon and some good damage from the Hunter will take oh, them down. It's Final K out of that whirlpool. And it's gonna take Pero a lot yo que me to hace, bro, the eh? with Final K peppering tons of damage back in. Final K finds the pick on Venenu PBM. We'll get the airstrike out of Barracuda and the dragon. Okay, full, full defense. And just kiss this right person who's built any kind of defense. Viva Vinicius. La verdad es que, la verdad es que sí, pero es que nunca me voy a poder tomar a Vinicius en serio, sinceramente. Sinceramente. Damage out and we'll find some good damage up against Ben and Jake. Will he find even more with the scream through the wall? Jake is just standing inside of everything and is already down to a quarter HP. The shells have all been popped to try and keep him alive. Bear is still holding on to Iz. A Riptide is good. Barracuda might not be able to find a way out. Does get the airstrike just in time, but the left side, Phoenix is already gone. Lasbra has found oh, Final in the back line. Will la find la a out. And a good Spirit Ball by Ven will finally hold back the Dragons, but it's not for long because Sam has found a double Kraken in the back line. Barracuda, half HP as soon as he walks back in the fight. PBM dashing in, finds a taunt up against Ven, gets the beads from the Bolt's mid laner, and the Dragons, aside from Sam, healthy enough to pull this Titan. The Jade Dragons have stormed in. They have taken game number one, finisaya, and finisaya. not much left for the Bolts to do to hold Madre back bien, this man. defense. Because more than likely, the Dragons are going to play in a way where if Hammer hit, then so now is the perfect opportunity Cuban. to go pick up those Cuban. balls. Cuban. Now, Cuban. the Bolts do have the pressure. They've got Sam rotating over Cuidado, the Sam, Dragons. Man, go, 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 go. Kraken and take oh. it down, and it could be a double as awesome Jake falls in the drag. Take this purple. One good body block from Jake. Should mean that Lasbra cannot grab this one away. Provov is secured by the Olympus Bolts. They won't lose it. out on that. PBM will be chased down though by Lasbra and Jake. That gets the transformation out. Panicat used the ultimate 50. to buy some distance. That way Mike can find a path out. But that was yes, Kingslayer so? used during all that. And a Kraken on awesome Jake. A collapse by the Jade Dragons and Panicat. Takes big on the Sam for soccer going, but turn their eyes to Pyromancer. Looks a little bit Tienes more muy pressure con el Uber, no sé por qué no se lo banean ella. Ay, ay, ay. Uf, que lo robaban las britas, eh. PBM is now all by himself. Has the leap to get away. One veil opened up by Haddix. Jake goes in. PBM very low. Tío, but holding on to the transition to the last moments con la that he can. Onda. But as soon as he lands down, he's thrown right into the wall. And it's a kill for Haddix. It looks like Venenu will turn into Final K and ult back into this fight. But Lasper's getting very low here. One hits all that's needed. Pagon finds him. And now Pagon is stunned out. Used the beat. Uy, se the big knees. Sai, no? A 180 ah. exhaust, but it sends the fade away by Ven to take down Pagon. But watch out for Pandacat, who's now rotated into the fight. Haddix. Fighting against three, and he's not the only one that hey, can utilize man, the wall. Final K keeps himself alive, and Sam Leon, finds eh? the kill. Down from the prior engagement. Yeah, that was a lot of damage coming through, and now Sam Rosaka just dropping the crack and a little bit missed, and we'll have to beat Awesome Jake. Not gonna be in trouble anymore. That's the go button for Lazbra. Ankh pots by Mike, and Lazbra will not continue the chase up to Sam. This time it's Mike transforming aggressively into the dragon. Jake. Trying to jump away as fast as he can, but he gets stunned out. Sam finds Lasbra. Jake is so low, it? so close to going down. Mm. One more tick would have done it, but it's Ooh. not enough. And the Hail of Arrows just off the mark. So unfortunately for the Dragons, they don't find the kill on Jake, but they do find Lasbra, and they do bien, get a kill. Bien, 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 bien. Like Así me gusta, así me call them selfish. Maybe they are going to be a little bit selfish. Final K fighting for his blue buff. Doesn't get it, but Haddix 
probably won't make it out of here. The passive will not save him as one more auto puts him into death threshold are not safe. Now the J-Dragons probably don't even need to get a pick like they're finding on Awesome Jake to grab an objective. They could probably just go ahead and take one if they want to, but you might as well take a life if you're able to. Jake will find a jump out, but that's not as far as he is going to get. So let's we'll see where he goes. It's Fire Giant by the Bolt. Half HP. Final K is here to slow them down. Last person getting an insane oi, amount oi, of damage. Oi, oi, the Aegis oi, oi. will buy Lasbra enough time. The Kraken Guess goes I through. Are. And the Olympus Bolts do get the Fire Final Giant. Bolts. But can they find themselves a way out of the fight? Final K has found Jake. And one more crit will take down the support. This is going to be a massive win for the Olympus Bolts. Just Jake and getting Fire Giant. <laughs> they don't know he's here yet. Ben, you don't want to take this 1v1. And did they not hear him? I, I think they may have heard him, but they didn't know where he landed. Now, as soon as he comes out of stealth, he'll be hit with a stun. Barracuda trying to box up against Fine. Okay, hang on. Soaking up some of the tower damage. PBM's on the wrong side of the tower. He'll be able to jump back. But how will the fight go after Barracuda? As soon as he lands, eats a ton. Sam for soccer being chased out by Lasper. The jungle and Hat will sweep in and take the kill. But Lasper still has the ult here. He's trying to chase this one down. Anyone to take oh some Lord. of this CC Panda Cat. See you later. Haddix is getting very low as Mike jumps in. Mike chose in with Final K. Huge it's Final the two K. frontliners oh. trying to fight, but it's the two frontliners. It's getting absolutely blown nice. up. And now it's Pagon Sata. versus the rest of the bolts. He'll jump away from Ben. Pagon turns around to box up against it but the jade dragons el nexo me lo viene a resegar pero por lo menos me colea el lo siento air strikes out but he'll be met by fine by pbm ahora mismo soy más interesado en que ganen los dragons from the root right after barracuda goes down quick so huge the bolts were around to help that one and unfortunately barracuda fenny a fenny a fenny it's gonna be a phoenix if they don't get back quick but there's still a draconic transformation there is still three adcs here and a poseidon and it looks like the Olympus Bolts will back just in time. And there's a frenzy up for PBM too. As soon as Coerce comes back, the Dragons could. Comprate otra PC para que juegues. Que quiero streamear, hermano. En cuanto me van a streamear, me van a ir otra vez. Da igual que jueguen la Switch. Da igual que jueguen casa de mi tío. Da igual. Nos vamos, nos vamos, raza, nos vamos. Sam. Full HP doesn't have that crack, and Final K is going to be the first one to go down in this fight. It's Haddix who picks up the kill. The Bolts have found one. Massive, but they have to go in here for this Phoenix, and the Coerce goes down. Frenzy gets popped, and they're going in. A lot of damage from Haddix through the wall. Awesome Jake falling low as well. Kraken just off the mark, but Panacat does have the basic to finally items. slow that one down. First kill up, Final K goes in, but it will immediately go to the side of the Phoenix, and that one will go down right no, away afterwards. Fight, the claro. Dragons. Have finally broken the base of the Olympus. Won't need those, but they're going in anyway. Haddock throws some big damage up against Panic Cat. Having the Hunter even Haddix, lower than eh? that. Lasper goes in, but an Ankh gets popped right away. Sam tries to push Lasper out, but Lasper still finds that kill. All the while, Pagon just off the mark with the bladed arrow. And it'll be a jump. Well, that's group up, and that's the call for the Jade Dragons. Transformation out of Mike, and should be a coerce and a frenzy right after to start this fire giant. Ben has already made his transformation. He's already dove his way into Ay the back Dios. line. PBM is the one who's low in HP. He'll find the jump out, but he'll get rooted right in place. And the Kraken, not going to oh. do an insane amount, but it's already two down for the Jade Dragons. Final K in the back line, boxing up against everybody that he can. He's going to need some backup for Pagan. Uh, He's going to need some help from Sam for soccer. And he'll get just that. Final K are already gone. Pagan gets knocked up. And Jake will jump himself dámelo, dámelo, out. Dámelo, dámelo, dámelo. Barracuda dámelo. still holding Quiero on to the airstrike. strike. We'll find a path out. Ay, ay, lo crítico del barra. Damage. Barracuda. We'll nice, que buena piscina está tirando el Sam. We'll go down to fight, okay. I don't really think it matters if Jake dies because Paracuda is doing so much damage. That's a oh, huge is going to take a bunch. He's critting back though. One more. Un tres, un tres, pegón. He'll be able to squeak out. Hax is going to stop fight, okay, from going back. Fight, okay, will dash into a wall of his own. Hax can continue this chase. Pegón al lepil. Is right around the corner, right around the wall. And instead, the hunters will turn their sights to the pyromancer. No fire between the teams, but what a bloodbath! Yeah, Soccer's Kraken is almost free fire. Free fire. Searching for whoever's here. For now, he only sees Barra. Haddix has not been spotted on the backside of the fire giant pit. He can make his way in. Barracuda all no by himself. Really, no the really. Just off the mark by Mike, but the crits by Panda are even better. Kraken will find two, but not to El a lot Kraken of damage yet. Panda Cat still picks up the double eh, kill all the while. Y... And now it's Lazra. Haddix and Ben left to defend. Oh, the final game that's the open one. Lazra nice is Tumble BM. He's done. Evanetu down. It's a triple kill for Panda Cat. Nice. Lazra is the only one that can really help right now. Haddix is still hiding in the back line, but so many low health bars. Pagan's going to jump in here. Jump in. Axe toss. Gets beads the way. PBM needs to find the stun on Haddix if they want to find this kill. He will. Pagon swaps on over. Panacat goes in. Pagon picks up the 
Yeah, you can. And it doesn't look like Enhanced Fire Giant is on the menu just yet. Lazbra is here, and left side Phoenix will be dropping shortly. Look at the health bars, though. Sanford Soccer is one skewer away from death. Lazbra could go massive here. He has the Magi shield. He has the CC to be able to immune this, and Pagon is going to spot him out. Pagon knows he's there. Axe Toss is off the mark, but the Fire Giant has it melted under the hands of the Jade Dragons. Not a chance that Lasper can steal that one away, but make the jungle here. I don't imagine they want to leave anywhere out of their face. Qué malo, yo que sé, Mesky, no sé ni lo que es, cabrón. M by himself against four. <laughs> Deandre Paddock's Kraken will clip Barracuda, and Pagon will put him down. Transformation out of Mike, and there are Dice still three skin. sitting within the jungle, but a couple of Magis si will be fine. Jake eso, will pick up Mike, and only Pero Mike. Jake no. will not make his way out. It's fine, okay, to put him down. But Venator nice, trades out to get one, but fine, okay, finds the double kill. It's already Ooh, four, and make it five. Algo. The Jake el Dragon will algo. move on to the final day of play. The Olympus Bolt will go home because it's a 2-0 for the Jade Dragons to close this set out. You just can't put all of your damage into Polar Bear Mike there. Pagon with a clutch hail of arrows to make sure to confirm that kill on a Barracuda. If Airstrike gets off, that could have been...